Wrenching news for one family after days of searching for 18 year old Jasani Smith. The Claiborne County Sheriff's Office confirms the teen's body was found three miles south of Bob Hall Pier this afternoon, but it's what was near the body that has passerbys on the beach in awe. Our Taylor Elnice was at the scene and had tonight's top story. What was supposed to be a fun day for 17 year old Jasani Smith and his friends ended in tragedy when his body was pulled from the water here. On Sunday afternoon, Patrick Reyes was fishing with his friends at mile marker 271, just south of Bob Hall Pier, when he saw something in the distance. I was fishing, I was out waiting in the water about 100 yards out, then uh, I guess the, the body ended up floating up, and yeah, about 50 yards from me. Reyes says he and his friend pulled a young man's body onto shore while someone called police. This was an unfortunate accident. An hour later, Claiborne County sheriffs confirmed the news that everyone was dreading. It was missing King High School senior Jasani Smith. Teachers and family, everybody right now is hurting. Police say on Thursday, Smith was caught by rip current near Whitecap Beach. He went under and never resurfaced. Thousands of people, including family, friends, first responders, and even strangers, joined the Coast Guard since then searching for Smith. This was a total accident, and, and we just got to keep everybody in prayer right now. Fernando Zaragoza was there to hear the news after Smith's body was pulled from the water. He says Smith was friends with his son, and he's known him for years. He would laugh. He was always humorous. You know, taking jokes, giving jokes. I mean, Jasani was just the life of the party. Aragosa says he's heartbroken Smith is gone, but says he touched many lives and will never be forgotten. Smith's friends say the most significant thing about today is this cross overlooking the waters where his body was found. At Mile Marker 271, Taylor Alanis, 3 News.